Also, for all those of you that have commented on my sickness and who have been saying that I keep getting sick all the time and that maybe something is wrong with me, let me tell you something. I haven't been sick for months. The last time I was sick was when I caught COVID, which I think was three to four months ago. Back then I did some similar streams without the mic and cam because I was in the same boat. Like, you know, I still want to stream. I still want to create content for all of you. I still want to be around. Um, so if the choice is to stream with my, without mic and cam or not stream at all, I'm going to do it. And I thought the same these past days. Now, because I get COVID and I am sick for around a week, four months ago, and because I catch a cold now, after being in Malmö for the LEC final, around 11,000 other people, doesn't mean that my health isn't optimal. It doesn't mean something is wrong with me or my immune system. In fact, I've talked to a lot of other people who got sick after being in Malmö and at first I was worried that it might be COVID again, but I've tested negative um, on every COVID test I've taken since coming home, which is good. So it's not COVID, but I did catch a cold one way or another. It's been a bit of a rough one. It is what it is, you know. Also, for what it's worth, when it comes to getting over colds, <clears throat> it does take 7 to 10, to 10 days for the cold, the sickness, to be entirely out of your, your body, out of your system. Currently, in this moment, I am on day 6. So we're not at the 7 day mark yet. Meaning that nothing is wrong with me. I just call it cold. It sucks. It's not ideal, but it happens to the best of us. But yeah. With that out of the way. Again, I'm going to be talking a bit less than usual. Please, uh, please bear with me. I'm curious to see how this bot lane plays out. Very nervous, actually. What color ward here? I've had some good Kha'Zix games yesterday. Hopefully we can keep that up now. This champ actually feels really powerful. And we're against a couple of squishies, which is the most important part for Kha'Zix. At least with the way that I like to play him. Full lethality, full assassin style. I wonder what Viego is up to. Found him. Oh, they got outplayed pretty hard, but they also decided not to flash. Well, I think that's the main reason it went so wrong. Well, it is the main reason for sure. They should just have used their sums. This guy didn't have any sums, so he was pretty free. But yeah, seeing Lena's die without using their flashes is never the most enjoyable. It's alright though, we have strong Riven, 
We have Vicio on Salia mid. So even if bot lane doesn't do well, we're gonna be fine, I think. Might be able to look top again after Crump, honestly. Hold on, Riven. The hub is on the way. Diego might be close, but it shouldn't matter. Bot lane is having a lot of fun. A little too much fun if you ask me. But then I guess it was expected. It's always tricky in games like these because on the one side I want to help my bot lane, but on the other I know that if I try we're probably just gonna die, because they put themselves so far behind while dying with flashes up twice for both of them, by the way, that I, I just don't think I can help them. I think there's no hope, but I just need to help solo lanes. Mid is tricky though, because it's a Kali, she's really hard to gank. We need to look out for Pike now. He's probably just gonna be a second jungler from here. I'd be able to look up here. If she pushes fast, Viego won't make it. I'm gonna ward here. I'm just trying to get a system more than anything here. This Orn can't play anymore. Now oh, we find out who can carry hardest for the top lane. Time will tell. It's usually better getting bot lane ahead though, because in bot you have two people winning. So Kaiser is going to be really strong while Pike can just roam. Yeah, we'll find out. Yasuo still has flash, should be a kill for him. Ooh, he walked back on the turret instead of walking away. That's a spicy decision. I'm not sure why he decided not just to run and live. We each their own. Really strong, but not sure if I can do anything. Oh, he ulted on Sona to escape. I'm dead. He actually pulled me, my god. That was so smart by Pike though. He played that so clean. No, well, maybe going bot was a mistake. Like I said earlier, it's just hard to help them now. They've ruined their lane to an extent where even, you know, junglers can't really do anything to stop them from being smashed. It's too brutal. I legit have blocked this Yasu and I can still see his pings. Like, why is that a thing? I have blocked all communication with him, right? I don't want to see his pings, thank you. Wait, our oh, Riven just died. Wait, did she... Did she get solo killed? I think Orn solo killed her. Ooh. Well, if Riven starts losing 1v1, then... Then the fun begins. I couldn't make it before he paced. He's walking up. I don't know if he's trolling or if Viego is here. Maybe he's just trolling. He will behave so strange in this video game. Like, why would he walk up there if he's alone? Because part, part of me was like, hmm, maybe Viego is around. There's no way this guy would walk up alone like this, knowing he's gonna die, but then he actually did. I need to pop Herald soon. Maybe we just pop him in here.
Wait, where are you going, Riven? Well, she wants to kill them, I guess. I mean, it's so obvious. We should just go mid for plates. They're gonna come from base. They all reset. But we have to hurry up. At least for plates we're doing well. They got three plate spots, but we've gotten two full turrets. Oh yeah, so we can get a plate pot as well. And one HP. All of them. Sola, do something. What? My Q didn't go off. He flashed my Q damage. I didn't get assist. And I'm dead. <laughs> Now on TP till we lose. Oh god. Uh, that's... Really sad. <laughs> that's just so sad. You all can want Yumi gone all you want, but Pike is a demon? <laughs> you think so, Emily? I mean... Not gonna lie. I'm kind of with the rest of the chat on this one. If I could choose between removing Yumi or Pike, I would remove Yumi any day of the week. But I think you all know by now that I'm just... I'm not really the biggest Yumi fan. Let's just put it that way. Yumi is certainly not my favorite champion to play against. But yeah, this Pike is very annoying. He's created 12 out of the 14 kills. He's a bit of a monster. Orn is playing smart. I can't get to that backline because he's blocking my path. Oh, huge Talia combo from Vitio. Not again. They're escaping with 1 HP again. This actually keeps happening. How can they keep surviving like this? Oh, no, no, no. That's one. No. I trolled. I somehow managed to use my auto attack on a raptor. Oh, no, not my auto attack, my Q on a raptor. Imagine if he escaped off of that. That would have made me very sad. Oh. This midwave is pretty juicy, not gonna lie. <laughs> I could get used to this team doing the objective while I farm midwaves. Yes, please. Vizio played that mid fight super well, but he just doesn't have damage enough yet. So soon when he has more items, he can start really destroying people in fights. I'm obviously getting pretty fat too. I'm actually thinking of going to roll the second item. Is that troll? I think it's not bad, because they have two people who are so tanky. Like, I just don't deal damage to Viego and on without this. I think we, 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 we go to roll this here. Now we can bring the damage. I went so ham. Greedy, greedy boy. Look at that damage though. Ooh. Let's hope she doesn't hold. Seems like we're fine. My damage is crazy. I love this champ. Yeah, but so good. Let's try 
Trying to be sneaky here. Okay, so it was too smart. I to fight this, I can actually deal damage to own. HP, nice. Got him. <laughs> nice. This is working out pretty well. We should get Drake. Wouldn't mind stacking some Cloud Drakes. That would be pretty juicy. On this champion, just sneaking around. With stealth, jumping people. I might force it if they're desperate enough. It is 19-19 on kills, but they're extremely behind on gold. I want to flank if possible, so I can get onto their backline. This one is key. Nice. Come here, Kali. No. Boring. Oh, we did get a window. Even though bot lane was having a tough time, it looks like uh, we got our conclusion. Top side, stronger than bot side, confirmed. <laughs> Good game. Good game.